Dante point. Strider may cry. Love this team. Can somebody activate Windows for us, please? This happens every week. All right, great start here for Asus. Snapping in the Strider, doesn't want to deal with it. Unfortunately, Punk has two anchors in the back. So even if you kill Strider, you still got to deal with Virgil afterwards. Yeah, but it seems the optimal way to do it because if you uh, take care of Strider, it puts Virgil second and That's Dante true. last. Yeah, I've, ne I've not seen Punk play Strider before, so this is new for me. Oh, great block there from Punk, though, but honestly, a lot of top Street Fighter players that come into Marvel have phenomenal blocks. Ryan F, of course, every time I watch him play, his blocks are ridiculous. So Look at that. I love that work off the jam session. He's going to fall out, though, unfortunately. And this could get him punished there. Oh, no, he's going to be able to do this just in time. Doesn't punish, though. Really difficult to punish that. And scary, too, since Asus has uh, DAC options. Absolutely. You see the respect on the stare down after jam session? Yeah, that chip, though, does Aces in. And Nova is going to take big Ooh. damage here. X Factor, let's go. Should be able to get an easy kill here on Aces Dormammu. Oh, no, but drop. And now I think Aces is going to X Factor in return. Has to. You got to take care of Virgil no matter what, right there. Especially because he's so, so, so. Crazy, just scary. <laughs> All right, Punk, though. Dante's his best character, but Dante's not going to get the play. He's just going to eat this. There we go. Ace is on the board right there. Ace takes the lead 1-0. to zero. So far, it's looking like all aces, really. I mean, Punk had a moment there with Virgil where he was making something happen, but dropped the combo. Oh, looks like Punk got hit trying to get an airplay out preemptively. Yeah, no, unfortunately, I don't think Dante does extremely well against Nova. I feel like maybe Morgan would have been the better choice. Yeah, but I think if you're definitely going to go against uh, Nova, you want to put those preemptive M's out or H's out early into airplates instead of airplates first. Oh, another big drop there. All right, Aces going for the uh, Rocket Punch Super, but Punk able to suit DAC in. Gets mixed up, though. No good block this time. And he doesn't even build any meter for this since he's in Devil Trigger. Oh, but another drop there That's from Aces. Aces. Aces has dropped three combos already in this match, and it is costing him big. Oh, Jam Session rips them all together right there. It's huge for Punk. Should have enough here for sure. Okay, he's going to be able to DAC and one more time. Yeah, you got Legion behind, all the birds. That's all, that's wrap it up. Yeah, I think Dormammu may have a little bit of health left, but that's not going to matter too much here. Yeah, he's going to smoke Dante. I was for sure I was going to kill. He could have 20 meters, and this would still be difficult. And Punk ties it up one to one. All right, there we go. So there we go. Aces gets the box dash H, catches Dante. See if Aces can complete the combo this time. He goes for the snap again. He doesn't want to deal with Strider. I mean, honestly, Vajra is so deadly in the back. Especially against Aces' team, which they're all box dash or flight characters. Oh, gets the reset, though. Oh. Punk able to get a throw there on Aces' mix up attempt. Got a mix up coming. Oh, Jam like session a, teleport. Kind of like a Street Fighter reset. Kind of let him, let him get up. Hey, that works, man. Jam Session and Virgil's best friends, brothers, you know? All right, we'll see the mix up here, though. Unfortunately, not able to get anything. Aces return, able to evade everything there. Gets hit by Rapid Slash, but no conversion. Good blocks right there. Gets clapped. And, and then, you know, the Rapid Slash and the Swords again works. Punk is getting a lot of mileage here out of the jam session assist. Punk is running out of meter, though. He's only going to be able to sword up one more time. Oh, he was hoping that was going to hit him right there. Catches them both. Yeah, great flank dash there into Stinger, able to get both. Oh, this sword is going to hit both. All right, Magneto's already coming in half health, so this is a good, good placement for Punk right now. Yeah, Punk really not using the jam session assist as well as he could have there to get the incoming mix-ups, but 
with Jam Session in play, this is definitely Punk's mutual. Stinger right there. If he can convert this, it could be enough. Keep it yeah. simple. Oh. Unfortunate drop there. He, Punk was so close for closing that game out. Now Dante's going to have to incoming mix up. Oh my god. Oh, pieces. Can he do it? And he does. Wow. That was wild right there. Okay, back in the neutral. Aces lands the first hit, opts out, goes back for the overhead. The light and catches Dante. Looks like we're probably gonna have a snap here for Strider again. It's kind of the route he's been going this whole time. Definitely does not want to deal with Vajra. Catches Punk Strider, and this should be a dead Strider right here. And he does. Looking very strong for Aces right now. Let's see what Punk can do. Oh my god, just gets cracked by the overhead. Aces paid attention and instantly X Factor to take care of this one meter. And now you have Dante sent on the backside with half health. Stocking player to set up a mix. Oh look, Aces just kind of sat there until he got push blocked. That was a good helm breaker. Cancel into uh, camera right there. Yeah, Punk doesn't really have a lot left here, but he's got plenty of meter and X Factor, but he doesn't have any characters left. Ace is going to take the set three to one. Punk getting so close to qualifying here for uh, top 24, but that is going to be the end of his tournament run.